Let's try this example. 5x equals 5, 2x plus y equals 4, 3x plus y minus 4z equals negative 15. Sometimes when variables are removed from these systems of three equations, it looks like it makes the problem harder. But oftentimes it actually makes the problem easier because they're doing work for us in a sense. So let's look at this one. We don't, you don't always have to use the addition or elimination method to solve these things. Sometimes you can just use substitution and work your way through it. Let's see. Right here, 5x equals 5. If I divide both of these by 5, I get x equals 1. And we're already down one variable. Okay, now I'm going to plug in here. Right? Doing that, I have 2 times 1 plus y equals 4. Huh, subtracting the 2 from both sides gives us y equals 2. Now we're two variables down. All right, and now we have x and y, so we can plug in right here to get z. So I'm plugging in x right there, y right there. We have 3 times 1 plus what well, y is 2, 2 minus 4z equals negative 15. All right, well, 5 minus 4z equals negative 15 negative 4z, I'm subtracting 5 from both sides, equals negative 20. Divide both sides by negative 4. We get z then must be 5. Okay, so that wasn't so bad. We just did some substitution. Here's our final answer in an ordered triple. 1, 2, 5.